No, this is definitely what he looked like. So Sam's drawing is right on the money? It's pretty exact? Absolutely. Okay, look at these. Who took these pictures? These are the... The circus promoter uh, gave me some publicity stills of the strong man. Now, the mask is different here. Yeah, it's a straight half mask. Right. And in Sam's drawing, excuse me, it curves down on the side. To cover the scar. Possibly. In fact, probably, although it's not going to make much difference if this guy doesn't come forward. How is Stacy doing with all that? She's trying to coax him along, but uh, if that doesn't work, we're just going to have to trap him somehow. You're exhausted, aren't you? No, no, no. Oh, I'm come okay. on. You're talking to me. I can tell. I mean, all of this is starting to really put a strain on you, isn't it? And Nicole. She's fine. She's back at the salon working this away. This supposed to be such a happy time. You're supposed to be planning your wedding and all Don't you worry are... about us. We're going to be married in a few weeks and you're going to be free. Concentrate yeah. on that. Easier said than done, pal. I know, pal. Question. Okay. How about if I bring in a hypnotist? F for what? To help you remember details of what happened. Honey, I've told you everything I know. Okay. Okay. Bigger question. What? How about if I put you on the witness stand and bring in a hypnotist? Please, Cass, don't ask me to what do that. What are you afraid Please. of? You, you may have seen the real killer. I didn't see anything. I you may at least you be that. able to give us a clue I as to how... I am liable to say anything. Anything. What if I talk about Noah? What if I tell them all how I killed my own stepfather? I mean, is that going to help me? We just won't mention Noah's name. I mean, don't you understand? They are linked together in my mind. But you'll be responding to my questions. Yes. I only know that Noah died because, because I, I saw him falling. I saw the glass. I saw it shatter on the floor because of what okay, Jason did. Easy. Because he all fell right. through the mirror. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't think about it now. We'll bring it up. We'll talk about it some other time. Don't ask me to do this, please. I'm so afraid of a hypnotist. It's so dangerous. God, I don't want to go to prison. Oh. There are lots of different kinds of prisons. Honey, you've been in one for the last 23 years. Dad, what is it? It's nothing. I just was thinking that I realize sometimes how, how lucky I am. What? what? That you're my son. I'm proud of you. Well, you should be prouder on Friday, right? Why's that? Remember the swim meet? You promised you'd be yeah, there. On Friday? Yeah, it's kind of a father-son tradition. You know? Right. <clears throat> I should do well in the 100 meters. Got all those lessons. What lessons? Nothing. I was just thinking about all those summers that your mom made sure you had swimming lessons. <laughs> most of which I missed. Are you sure there's nothing wrong? No, nothing's wrong. Look, like, you know, I made a promise that I was going to dance at your wedding. I don't want to miss that. Well, you might just get a chance to do that. Or not this week or anything. That's a pre-engagement ring. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, then... There's something I want you to have. What? You always said you liked this one the best. Dad, that's your favorite camera. Well, it's sort of a uh, father-son tradition. Sort of a pre-engagement gift. Go on. <sighs> you sure you want me to have yeah, this? Yeah, have fun. Always have fun. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay, well, I, um, I better, okay. I better get going. She's expecting me at the library. I'm happy for you. Give her my best. Yeah, I will. You know, if you ever want this back, you just tell me. And... I won't be needing it for a while. Take care of yourself. Right. Bye. No matter. I love you. I know I haven't told you that very often, but I love you. I love you too, Dad.
They've offered him the position of chief of staff at the hospital. Of course, he'll have to be approved by the board. I'm sure he will be. Of course he will be. He'll be flying in from Switzerland today or tomorrow. So he's coming back. Yes. He may bring his daughter Olivia with him. He's married. Divorced. Don't get any ideas. Oh, Liz, that's what I love about you is your subtlety. Well, it'd be wasted on you. Now, just keep your distance. For your information, I'm seeing John Hudson. We're quite close. I wasn't talking about love, Charlene. I was talking about money. What? Yes. Russ is wealthy. I remember how you can count a man's money while you smile. Oh, Liz. I'm trying to be polite, but I'm getting tired of all this. I've got a new life now. But no money. I own part of Frame Construction. John gave you that? No, I inherited it from my brother. Which is all I have to say to you, excuse me. All right, all right, all right, Charlene. Remember the mistakes you made. Remember how badly you hurt Russ. Please leave him alone. What do you mean? The woman I was in Europe with was Iris Wheeler. That's impossible. No, it's not. But she s said she was my friend. Donna, it had been over a long time, all right? I, I, we had to get on with our lives. You and Iris? Yes. Yes, of course. You and Iris had to get on with your lives while I was kept in the dark. She obviously didn't want to interfere with what we had. With what, with what you had with Iris or what you had with, with me? Donna, come on. Why are you defending her? I, I'm not defending her. When I her. think of all the times that that woman has insinuated herself into our lives, the snowflake ball, moving into this building, and the little episode with the lights where she was too afraid to call anybody else for help. Donna. That piranha. Look, all right. I'm, 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 oh, she was <clears throat> always pumping me, always asking for information about you. This all makes perfect sense. It's my fault. My fault, all right? I should have told you sooner. You should have told me when you first came back, and you certainly should have told me before you married me. I didn't know. I didn't know I'd ever see her again. I didn't know that she was she was Mac's daughter. I mean, she, when I met her, she was Iris Wheeler. This changes everything. What? What does it change? What? I I I had this this picture of you. What picture? You knew I wasn't a monk all those years. No. Neither were you? No, of course all I right, wasn't. So then what's the problem? It, now it's just out in the open. Well, maybe I shouldn't be so angry at you. I cannot help it! Look, since I've been back in Bay City, I have been absolutely 100% faithful to you, and I swear to that. You I swear to the death! You don't have to tell me that. I know. So can we put this behind us now, please? Are you kidding? I can't wait to have a little chat with Iris. You can't. You watch me. You can't. You watch me. You can't. She left town. <laughs>